Alright, what's up guys? I'm going to show you how you can win Annoying Orange from the Claw Machine. So yes, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks on how you can win this guy right here. Um, as you can see, um, I'm at my house. This is my own claw machine, as you can see. This is not an arcade. And um, I'm going to show you how you can win them. So basically, for Annoying Orange, what you want... Uh, the way you want an or uh, orange to be is you want it to be up. Any orange that might be up, off, like, if say if he was like this, that would be really bad because he's really dug in and the claws would have a hard time getting around him. If he was more like this, kind of, like that, that would be a lot easier to get him. But what you want to make sure with annoying orange is that the claw is the right size. So for my claw, it would actually be a really good size because um, it fits in the claw perfectly. I know a lot of claws that are too small or too big for annoying orange, and that's something you want to look out for. Especially in Sugarloaf claws, a lot of the claw machines, um, the these guys are too big for the claws. They don't close. Um, the, the claw is too small for it to get around it, and it has a really hard time. I actually won this guy in particular from a Sugarloaf claw. Um, he was actually up really well. Like he was, he had a lot of good leverage. Say he he was kind of like, even like kind of like this, even more maybe like, up like that. He was just sitting perfectly, and and it was a beautiful clamp. The video should be up soon, but when I win him, um, it was a beautiful clamp on him. So that's something you want to get on annoying orange. Now if the claw machine is filled with annoying oranges, say nothing else in here but annoying orange, I don't have enough to do that to show you, but if it was filled with them, you want to be careful because a lot of claw machines that are filled with good license plush are rigged. Because if they're not, the, I doubt the owner has enough money to give out like Angry Birds or annoying oranges every time someone plays because alone these guys are probably like a couple bucks just to buy them so if you win them for 50 cents then the guy is losing money and um so i'm i'm pretty sure he would have to make money somehow and usually they'll be rigged usually not always but it'll either pick it up and drop it or it won't grab something like that so i'm going to show you what i mean let's go for annoying orange she's kind of dug in in fact i'm going to turn my claw weak a little bit It's not like impossible to win, it's just weak. Kind of like a sugar loaf. See, uh, as, oh, it almost actually got him. As you can see, when the claws got under it, they were actually closing by the time it was still dropping because the stuff around it actually made it close more. Um, let's try for him again. Camera seems to be kind of blurry, sorry about that. Zoom out. Okay. So let's go for him again. Ooh, the claws closed really nicely. That's a perfect clamp right there. Even though he was dug in, the claw was actually able to get him. So um, you never know. I might weaken my claw a little bit more. Remember, the annoying orange is almost like a ball. It's really easy to get. In fact, it's easier than really anything else. Also, the material on annoying orange this stuff is actually a really slidey, like it's really slippery. So, alright, we're gonna go for this annoying orange. As you can see, he's dug in, so... If this claw digs in well, actually, it might still pick it up, but... Yeah, see, he was too buried, so I, I didn't get him. The claws didn't get around him. Got caught on right here on Scooby-Doo. Um, and so that wouldn't, that wouldn't be a good position. Now, uh, this annoying, uh, another annoying orange, I mean... <laughs> Got tongue tied and the phone is ringing. Um, let's go for him. He's really up. Um, there's actually a difference. This guy, his eyes are brown. His eyes are blue. I'm not sure which is the real one. I don't watch Annoying Orange a lot. He's too annoying for me. But I think it's brown. I'm pretty sure it's brown. Let's go for him. See, he was he was up a lot more, and that almost got around him. I went too much to the left. I'm sure I could get him again. In one more try. I'll show you guys. Go for him again. Remember, he the claws have to spin and get around him. So if it catches on this pig or something, it's not gonna get him. 
Oh wow, it actually got around him at the last minute and I was able to dig him out. That was a that was a cool grab. And so we got annoying orange. Now remember, not all claws are going to be as easy as this. That was actually really easy as I put it right there. It's just that no matter how weak it is, if it gets a good clamp, then it's going to hold it. Unless it's rigged. Unless it drops it every time. So let's go for it a little bit more dug in this time. See what happens. If the claws get around it, um, then it will still pick it up. So as long as the claws get around it, it's gettable. But see, I'm gonna have a, I'm not gonna have as good as a chance now because it's dug in, of course. Yeah, the claws didn't even get around it. It only went about there, so there's no way it could pick that up. Definitely how weak my claw is now. All right, guys, and that's how to win annoying orange. I hope my tips helped you. Um, next time you go to the arcade or wherever, like the supermarket or something like that, and you see annoying orange in the claw machine, you'll definitely know what to do. And now I'm just going to play. I have 29 credits on here. Um, and I'm just going to kind of play for you guys. Nope, didn't get him. I got to win both of the annoying oranges before I do anything else. Another thing is definitely, since annoying orange is like a ball, you probably want to use your angles. I usually don't on, uh, I usually don't on my claw because, you know, I don't care if I lose or not, but, oh, see, they got around them pretty well. They didn't get that clamp on them, so if it doesn't get that clamp, then it probably won't get it, unless it's strong. You gotta get that perfect clamp on them, just like that. There we go. Annoying orange. They also talk too, so makes them a little bit heavier. Not like really heavy, but you know, a little sound thing in them. Nope, the claws didn't get a, around them enough. What if I could hook a tag? With the annoying orange, you can actually, uh, if you have like a iPhone or something like that, and get this app where you can take a picture of this barcode and. I'll show you if I win this guy. Oh, there we go. There is a perfect clamp I'm looking for. You got him like perfectly. I'll show you. You can uh, take a picture of this little thing right here and I'll show you an exclusive video. So that's kind of cool. I'm actually running out of space on my camera, so. Um. Oh, hmm. Close. I'm almost out of space on my camera, so I might have to make this video a little bit shorter than I thought. Sorry about that, guys. This memory card doesn't hold a lot. We got Daffy Duck or uh, Looney Tunes. What was his name? Duck Dodgers. That's it. Duck Dodgers. Let's go for Porky, actually. There we go. Oh, oh, no. Uh, all right, I got 20 seconds left of filming to do, so finish that up. That should have him. Nice, got Porky Pig. All right, 10 seconds left. Let's see if I can win this Care Bear. All right, and we. All right, guys, and that's it for now. Um, I hope you like this tip video. If you guys want more tip videos, definitely hit the like button and definitely subscribe to me. And leave leave whatever you want um, in the comments below, whatever you want me to do tips on. Like winning domos or like uh, M&Ms, um, Looney Tunes, anything like that. If you guys have an idea of, you know, you might see it in your machine a lot, but have a hard time getting it, definitely leave a comment and uh, hopefully I'll reply to it and maybe even make a tip video about it. So thanks guys for watching. Uh, see you next time and be sure to subscribe.